Hi, my name is Kylie, and I'm so excited about today's field trip. We're going to learn all about horses in Kentucky. <laughs> Most of us have heard of the Kentucky Derby, but if you've ever traveled through the bluegrass region, you've probably noticed lots of board fences, huge green pastures, fancy barns, and beautiful horses. Those are some of several hundred thoroughbred racehorse farms that are close to Lexington, but that is just one part of Kentucky's horse heritage. We are visiting Kentucky Horse Park today to learn more about this fantastic animal. They have over 40 different types of horses here. It is super cool. Lexington is the horse capital of the world. There is one horse for every 12 people in Kentucky. I'd love to have a horse, but I'm afraid I can't keep it in my backyard. That would be a lot of fun, and horses are really fun to have, but they are a whole lot of work, and they typically need a little bit more than an average backyard. So a horse needs anywhere from two to four acres per horse. But in addition to that, you also need a good-sized fence, so something about as tall as you are. And then if your horse lives outside full-time, you'd have to have a shelter for it or some big trees for them to hide in if it rains or if it snows or gets really windy. Did you know that horses eat up to 2% of their weight a day? For a big horse, that is close to 20 pounds. 20 pounds would be about 80 hamburger patties, 128 single servings of ice cream, or 8,800 Skittles. Can you tell me about this horse? Hi, so this is Laura. She's our Suffolk punch here at the park. So she is a very rare breed. She's one of 3,000 left in the world. She stands around 16 hands and around 1,700 pounds. She's a big girl. What do you mean by hands? So hands is about four inches, or it's your hands sideways. We'll measure from the ground to her withers, which is kind of where her collar is sitting right now. Welcome in our quarter horse champion. This is Bia Bowen. Let's give him a big hand. This is Bia Bono and he's a racing quarter horse. Racing quarter horses are named quarter horses because they're the fastest at a quarter of a mile. And Bia Bono here, once in his career, raced at 54 miles per hour. What's he do now? Is he retired? So Bia Bono is fully retired. He gets to do the shows for the Holly Champions and he kind of just gets to live out his life and be with his best buddy, Mr. Muscle Man. They come in during the day and they get to meet and greet with their public. And then in the afternoons, they kind of just get to spend it by themselves and hang out and out in the field and eat grass all night. That sounds fun. Hey, good morning to you here from Rolex Stadium. Your 40 jumpers will start things off. I knew horses could jump, but did you know the highest jump on record is eight feet, one inch? And the furthest jump is 28 feet. That's over half the length of a school bus. That's amazing. Does it take a lot of people to care for the horses? It does, yes. So out here at the horse park, since we have so many horses, we have staff that work seven days a week between grooming, exercising, daily feeding. We also have to have a really strong relationship with our farriers and veterinarians. What's a farrier? The farrier is like the nail salon. So our fingernails get really, really long sometimes and we have to go and trim them and file them down. So the farrier comes out and he files our horse's hoofs down for them. It feels like a salon for our horses. Hello. He likes it. I want to give a big thank you to Kentucky Horse Park for teaching me so much about horses. Hmm, I wonder if my mom and dad will ever get me a horse. <laughs> 